club and a hostel for girls and who created basketball in the local area and then he uh, got a lot of people from local area and trained them, normally the girls and uh, he was not only giving the game and uh, he was teaching also languages and also he had a small boarding in Virginia. So he is one of the pioneers in Auroville. And, uh, of the basketball? No, Auroville. He is ah. a pioneer in ah. Auroville also. We as a as a how will we register our team in Pondicherry for the state? So whenever there's a tournament or not, we play for tournament uh, in Pondicherry. So it's always like that. And whenever we host a tournament, it is on state level. So there are around uh, 26 boys team and uh, seven girls team. So same level like sub junior, junior, and senior level. All this. Basketball has always been a large in Auroville because in Auroville we started like the pioneers or whoever started. It was a, one of the main game, so still continue. And uh, Jyoti, one of the main guys, who is teaching more than 60 kids every three days in, in a week. And there will be more upcoming tournaments in Auroville and also in Pondy because there are a lot of clubs have been uh, created. It's before it used to be only 12 teams. Now we are we are having around 26 teams, so 26 to 30 teams. So each team has to host a tournament. So they always there will be always a tournament upcoming. So one of the best uh, organizers will be Auroville because when people come to play in Auroville, they really enjoy. So. Uh, th this is why like lot of participation from Karekal, from Mahe. Mm -hmm.